Hello everyone, how are you all doing? I'm Diffuser 3 here and today for you I'm going to be showing you how to get Sony Vegas Pro 12 for free without any key gens or anything, just this one file you need to patch it. Anyway, first off what you want to do is download two files in the description. The first one's this little installer file, the second one's a WinRAR file. So start off just extract this WinRAR, WinRAR file. Um, the two downloads, the Installer one takes a few minutes to download in this win win raw can't say that word win raw file takes around um, two seconds to download and then you say yeah so now um, I just extracted it and I've got these two files so what you want to do is just open up this installer um, for me it'll take some time because my PC is really bad and um, yeah and then it you after you open the installer you just go through it and um, then you patch it and I'll show you how to do that so yeah, here we go just start it up and click yes yeah, take some time um, choose your language I'm right, English so get the English uh, read the terms and conditions you can read these if you want I don't really read these because there's no point um, create a shortcut desktop icon thingy because that will be good and um, yeah it'll just start doing this and um, this will won't take that long maybe a few minutes few seconds depending on your computer speed if you're really bad like computer if you have a really bad computer it might take a couple hours I don't know what kind of computer you have I've got a bad average kind of computer um, I have to say if you are getting this um, don't get this if you've got Vegas 11 because Vegas 12 and 11 are pretty much the same but if you got like 10 or lower so like 8, 9, 10 I don't know if anyone uses 7 but yeah 10 no yeah 8, 9, 10 whatever if you got those then I would recommend upgrading because they're new features but yeah if you've got 11 don't really upgrade because I I've used it before the Vegas 12 and I used to use 11 but and to be honest that the same there's like a few changes but I it um I you don't normally use them what they've changed like I think one of the changes is you can open After Effects project files and um some other stuff that you use on Mac like um Final Cut and stuff you can open those kind of files and yeah so that's a change but I don't even know if you guys would use that because if you're using After Effects you just finish edit editing in After Effects so yeah um, this is nearly done just a little bit more and yeah once it's done um, I'll just show you what you have to do so yeah cool got the desktop, I desktop icon and um, yeah it's nearly done uh, if, if, if this does take a really long for you, like I'm saying half an hour or something, then I wouldn't recommend using Vegas because then Vegas would be really slow on your computer as well. Anyway, yep, restart your system. No, I do not want to. You don't have to restart. I'll restart mine later, but yeah, you don't have to restart to use it properly. And yeah, so now you've got it here. Um, this is just the demo, what I've given you is the demo here and now to make it the full version you just want to open this and um, right click this whoops, right click this and open with an administrator and then you're going to click patch I'm telling you this now because there's going to be some loud music playing and um, yeah yeah so wait for it and yeah so this is it uh, it looks like an E but it's a C so just click patch it will say C and then wait for it to say OK see if it says OK and then you can just close it and now you have uh, the full version of Vegas Pro 12 so you can just double click this to open it um this will when you first open it first time it will take like quite a long time to load up because it's just doing all the stuff I think for me it won't take as long because I've had it I've, I got it before I just uninstalled it and quickly redid the process again because um just to show you guys how to do it but yeah this is a pretty cool to um 
way how to get it. You don't need a key gen or anything like that. I didn't really like using key gens before because they're kind of weird. You have to put all those serial numbers in and stuff. This way is so easy. You just use that pack to the knee and it's done. Pretty much that's it. Now I've got the whole version in. Yeah, it's awesome. So I'll just show you how it looks kind of. Um, so you can see. And yeah, if you want, you can try and do it now because there's no. You don't really have to watch this video anymore. That's pretty much it. And yeah. So here we go, here is the Vegas thing, um, yeah, so this is it, pretty much similar to Vegas 11, we've got some new stuff, I'll just show you a cool new thing that you probably haven't seen, I'll just import a clip, um, it's got some yellow boxes around, that's pretty much one of the only differences I've seen so far, so now when you've selected a clip you can see it easier that you've selected it but yeah that's pretty much the only difference in it and yeah that's about it um if you like the music in the background i'll put the li a link to that in the description and yeah have a great day and see ya